Hello, and welcome to Language Systems. This orientation will help you learn more about our school and its policies. Please follow along and feel free to ask questions afterwards in person if anything is unclear. Each term, Language Systems typically has a four-school event, such as our summer beach party and our volleyball tournament or our winter basketball tournament. At these events, all LSI students can experience American culture firsthand, practice English, and make new friends. Language Systems has 12 or 13 week academic terms made up of three sessions, A, B, and C. Each session is four or five weeks and is not dependent on the previous session. Therefore, students can comfortably begin studying at the beginning of session A, B, or C without missing the basic skills needed to understand their classes. In order to accommodate students who cannot begin classes on one of the official start dates, Language Systems now has open enrollment where students can start at any time. If you start classes in the middle of the session on an unofficial start date, please allow for an adjustment period and be aware that you have missed some of the material that is being studied in your classes. It is for this reason that adjustment periods, or the time spent studying from an unofficial start date to the beginning of the next session, will not be counted toward completion of that program. In order to complete a program and get a certificate, students must pass the complete 12 or 13 weeks of the term, starting from the beginning of a session. Language Systems offers classes in the morning, afternoon, and evening. Certain programs, like conversation and business, are offered in the afternoon or evening. Most levels of our ESL programs are offered in the morning, with some also being offered during other times according to student numbers and requests. Morning and evening class schedules are from Monday to Thursday, 4.5 hours a day. Afternoon class schedules are from Monday to Friday, 3.6 hours a day. The last day of the week is the test day. Please don't miss tests. Language Systems offers a variety of programs to fit our students' needs. These programs include ESL with seven levels, Intermediate and Advanced Conversation, Business English, English Through American Culture, as well as test preparation classes including TOEFL, TOEIC, GMAT, and GRE. Our ESL program has seven levels, from beginning to advanced, with three components in each level listening and speaking, reading and vocabulary, and grammar and writing. Students will have three different teachers in each level, with each teacher specializing in a specific component of English. Our ESL classes are usually offered in the morning, with afternoon and evening programs at some schools. If you do enroll in ESL and feel you have been placed in the incorrect level, please talk to the program coordinator for advice. It is recommended that you do not write in your books for the first few days in case you need to change classes. For students looking for extra pronunciation and conversation practice, Language Systems offers Conversation Management and Accent Reduction, or CMAR. This short afternoon class can be taken along with a morning class for a total of 22 hours a week. The class focuses on pronunciation and fluency in daily conversation. Our conversation programs focus more on fluency in speaking real-world English. It's available to intermediate and advanced students and include components like idioms, role-play practice, pronunciation, and presentations. This program is usually only offered in the afternoon and evening, so check with your school about availability. Language Systems offers business English for both intermediate and advanced students. In general, students focus on business communications, such as having general discussions, conducting meetings, or socializing in a business setting. More advanced students prepare presentations related to business. This program is usually only offered in the evening, so check with your school about availability. English Through American Culture is available for both intermediate and advanced students. This program is for students who wish to focus on their ability to learn about American culture and converse naturally and fluently in the English language while living in the United States. The classes present and reinforce everyday English skills with an emphasis on pronunciation and discussion. 
Language Systems offers test programs that focus on the strategies needed for obtaining the desired score on that particular test. Please note that students must first obtain the required level before entering or transferring to one of our test preparation programs. The Test of English as a Foreign Language, or TOEFL, is a test required by most colleges and universities, so if you plan to one day transfer, you'll probably want to consider the TOEFL class. The TOEFL class requires a score of level 5 or above for students wishing to join. It focuses on all parts of the TOEFL test and offers extensive practice on each section of the test, including three complete practice tests per term. TOEFL is typically offered in the morning, afternoon, and evening. The Test of English for International Communication, or TOEIC, is a test that is required for some positions overseas. The TOEIC class requires a score of level 4 and above. This class focuses on all seven parts of the TOEIC listening and reading tests and has a complete practice test every two weeks. TOEIC is mainly offered in the afternoon, so check with your school for availability. The Graduate Management Admission Test, or GMAT, is a test required of students wishing to enter many MBA programs. The Graduate Record Examination, or GRE, is a test required of many students wishing to enter other graduate programs. Due to the difficulty of the test, the GMAT GRE class is for advanced students placing into level 6 or above. This class focuses only on the verbal and written sections of the test and not on the mathematics. The GMAT GRE class is mainly offered in the afternoon, so check with your school for availability. School Policies and Rules Student ID Card Once you arrive at Language Systems, you may be issued a student ID card. You can use this student ID card as a secondary photo ID and may also receive discounts from local businesses and vendors. Textbooks Please buy your textbooks as soon as possible. All students are required to have textbooks and other materials for their classes. Headsets with microphones are part of the required TOEFL materials. If a student does not have a textbook, he or she will not be allowed into the class. Books can be sold back to LSI. LSI may buy used books from the students for half of the original purchase price. The books must be in good condition with all the answers erased inside. If the book is no longer being used during the following session, LSI cannot buy your books back. If you are not sure whether a class you are attending is the right class for you, please don't write in your books the first few days. Tardiness. You must be in class on time. If you come in during the first 20 minutes of the first class, you will be marked tardy. For the other classes, if you come in during the first five minutes, you will be marked tardy. Anytime you come in after 20 minutes in the first class or five minutes in the other classes, you will be marked absent for the record, even though you can remain in class. Three tardies equal one absence. If you are late, please be respectful of the teachers and classmates and try not to disrupt the class by arguing with the teacher or insisting that the class stop and review what you missed. Please note the on-time, tardy, and absent times on the clocks for the morning classes. Please note the on-time, tardy, and absent times on the clocks for the afternoon classes. Please note the on-time, tardy, and absent times on the clocks for the evening classes. Attendance. Attendance is an essential part of your experience here at Language Systems, so it is important to attend classes every day to make good progress in your English skills. As a student at Language Systems, you are required to maintain at least 80% attendance. If your attendance falls under 80% at the end of any term, you will be put on probation and required to maintain 80% attendance for the following term. If a student does not maintain 80% attendance during the probation period, he or she will no longer be able to continue at Language Systems. For the student's convenience, Language Systems offers makeup classes for students who wish to make up the work they missed. Absences. Students are not allowed excused absences. However, 
In special cases, such as appointments or religious holidays or illnesses, students may have participation scores excused and will be able to make up homework and tests. Students will be terminated if they are absent two consecutive weeks or more. Grading. Academically, students will be required to take a test every week and will have homework at least twice a week. Teachers will give every student a participation score at the end of each week. A participation score includes the student's performance in class activities and discussions, as well as if the student follows the classroom rules and is respectful of the teacher and other classmates. Satisfactory Academic Progress What is Satisfactory Academic Progress, or SAP? SAP includes grades for test, participation, and homework. Please note how SAP is broken down in the pie chart on this page. Requirements for level completion. In order to complete a level and move up to the next level, students must finish the entire term, including sessions A, B, and C. In addition, they must have maintained at least 70% satisfactory academic progress in their course. If students fail any course, they will be advised by the program coordinator before repeating it and will be given a study plan to follow. Tuition. You must pay tuition in person before the current tuition end date to avoid paying a late fee. A late payment fee of 5% per week will be charged if the tuition is not paid by the tuition end date. Vacation. You may take a vacation or personal leave of absence lasting one session, four or five weeks. To qualify for a one session vacation, a student must have completed a minimum of three consecutive sessions prior to taking a vacation for one session. In order to take a vacation, you must inform the front desk and pay renewal tuition to study after returning from vacation. If you leave the USA, you must inform LSI and have the DSO's signature on the second page of your I-20 in order to come back from overseas. Extension of I-20 if you wish to extend your program end date indicated on your I-20, you will need to contact LSI prior to the program end date to determine whether you are eligible to do so. Parking. You must park in LSI designated spaces or unreserved spaces only. Please talk to the front desk staff to learn more specific information about parking at your campus. Please note that some campuses may require that you purchase a parking pass or LSI provides validations to pay your parking fee at the pay station in the parking structure. Bicycle parking area. There is also a bicycle rack available for you to park and lock your bicycle. The front office staff will direct you to the bicycle area. Smoking. No smoking is allowed in the building. Smoking is allowed only in designated areas outside the building. Please talk to the front desk staff to identify the specific areas where you can smoke. Student Entrance. This rule applies to the South Bay LA Center only. Please use the student entrance on the side of the building. Due to other businesses in the building, students are not allowed to use the elevator. Change of Address. If you change your address or phone number, report it to the front office immediately. You are also required by USCIS to send in the form AR11 showing the changes. Going back to your country. When you finish your studies and are ready to go back to your country, you must submit a copy of your return flight ticket and LSI's exit form to LSI. If you complete at least one term or three sessions, without a leave of absence in the previous three sessions, you will have a 60-day grace period to go back to your country. If you do not complete one term or three sessions, you will have 15 days to go back to your country. Transferring to another school. If you intend to transfer to another school, you must submit an acceptance letter from the new school and LSI's exit form to LSI. 
If you complete at least one term or three sessions without a leave of absence in the previous three sessions, you will have a 60-day grace period to transfer out. If you do not complete one term, you must submit all necessary documents to transfer out before or on your tuition end date. Refund Policy The refund policy for students who have completed 60% or less of the period of attendance shall be a pro rata refund calculated from the last day of attendance, less a $150 non-refundable processing fee the $100 shipping and handling fee, and the STRF fee. English only in the classroom. Please use only English in the classroom while you are taking classes. At the front desk, our student advisors may speak your language to help you if necessary. Additional policies. Students may not attend class while under the influence of any controlled substance. Also, please don't wear cologne or perfume as it may bother people with allergies. We are here to help you. Office managers and student advisors deal with the business side of the program. Program coordinators deal with the academic side of the program. Don't be shy to stop in and introduce yourself as you begin your adventure at Language Systems. Our student advisors may speak your language, such as Chinese, Japanese, Korean, Portuguese, Spanish, Taiwanese, Turkish, and Vietnamese. Advisors from our other campuses may be available to help translate over the phone. For a complete list of school policies, please refer to the student catalog. If you have any questions about LSI policies or classes, please feel free to talk to the student advisor, office manager, or the program coordinator. Even if you don't have any questions, please come by and say hi. We are happy you chose language systems and will do our best to make your experience a memorable one. Check us out on social media. We provide a lot of useful tips for students, including our idioms and lifestyle blogs. And we know all the best places to go and things to do when living in Southern California. Plus, connect with other LSI students, make new friends, and practice English in a fun environment. Thank you for taking the online new student orientation.